money hungry. Dan Wharton takes brutal swipe at Harry as he sells Netflix or Royals secrets. Harry and Meghan Markle's docuseries is set to be released on Netflix in December. However, the Duke of Sussex has been heavily criticized by GB News host Dan Wooden for being in business with the streaming service following the most controversial season of The Crown dropping on the platform in November. Season 5 of The Crown focuses on Princess Diana and King Charles III's divorce in the 1990s and Diana's bombshell interview with disgraced journalist Martin Bashir. On Thursday's installment of his GB News program, Dan interviewed Lady Colin Campbell about the latest series of The Crown. Dan began, Well Lady C, I am actually so angry about this as I spent most of the weekend binge watching The Crown. I felt it was my responsibility to do so because we had Robert Lacey who is the historical advisor for the show on, GB News, this week. Dan said he wanted to make sure he wasn't just reading the reports about the Netflix drama, which is why he sat down and watched it all. I wanted to see it all for myself, and Lady C, that show has gone down the drain, he exclaimed. It is now an all-out assault on the current king, the queen consort, Princess Diana herself, but also, the late Queen Elizabeth II and the late Prince Philip. I mean how can Harry look himself in the mirror in the morning knowing he is in business with this lot, Netflix, it's beyond me. Lady C claimed the Duke of Sussex does not have any loyalty towards the royal family. She also deplored the latest season of The Crown as she agreed with Dan's points. Netflix has been contacted for comment by Express.co.uk. Netflix has previously defended The Crown, saying it is a fictional dramatization. A statement released by the streaming giant said, The Crown has always been presented as a drama based on historical events. Series 5 is a fictional dramatization, imagining what could have happened behind closed doors during a significant decade for the royal family, one that has already been scrutinized and well documented by journalists, biographers and historians. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex's documentary series will reportedly premiere next month. Prince Harry and his wife Meghan have been working with Oscar-nominated director Liz Garbus on the Fly on the Wall program and according to People magazine, royal fans have just a few weeks to wait before they can tune in. The couple, who have children Archie, 3, and Lily, 17 months, together, signed a multi-year deal with the streaming service in September 2020, where it was reported at the time their own Archul Productions company would create documentaries, docuseries, feature films, scripted shows and kids programs for the network. Former actress Megan recently spoke about their working relationship with Liz. She said, It's nice to be able to trust someone with our story, a seasoned director whose work I've long admired, even if it means it may not be the way we would have told it. Article content. But that's not why we're telling it. We're trusting our story to someone else, and that means it will go through their lens. It's interesting. My husband has never worked in this industry before. For me, having worked on suits, it's so amazing to be around so much creative energy and to see how people work together and share their own points of view. That's been really fun. The 41-year-old Duchess previously explained the docuseries will look at the love story between her and Harry. When asked about the project, she said, the piece of my life I haven't been able to share, that people haven't been able to see, is our love story. I hope that is the sentiment that people feel when they see any of the content or the projects that we are working on.